Well, what is up everyone? My name is Tay Chrono and welcome to Tay Chrono Plays Kirby in the Forgotten Land. So yeah, then this game just came out today and this is actually the first time I've touched this game. I didn't play the demo. I think there was a demo for it, but I just didn't download it, I guess. Anyway, I think this is Kirby's first 3D game, like in 3D in terms of being like this. I know he's been 3D before, it's just... I haven't played a Kirby game in forever. I think the last time I played a Kirby game was Return to Dreamland. That came a long time ago, but I did buy it recently just because I was like, you know, I'll play Kirby. Uh, but Kirby's been one of those things I actually enjoyed a lot. Uh, it's also kind of something that me and my friend always, whenever we think of doing a co-op, especially of Kirby, it's always... Kirby Superstar, it's like our go-to Kirby game to play, so checkpoint I don't know if there's any collectibles I don't know, but we're going to try to aim for 100% because that's just how I am Woo Also, playing a non-JRPG is also really kind of fun for the first time because commentating RPGs are a lot more was weird it's like a little frame rate issue right there. But, uh, commentating non JRPGs, like RPGs in general, I don't, is weird. Ooh, sword. Whenever it comes to new Kirby games, it's also kind of like Pokemon. It's like, ooh, what kind of Pokemon do we see in a new Pokemon game? It's like, what new abilities do we get? And so we only have sword right now, which is. Hang on a second, do I have an install button? Yes. Uh, oh, they don't have the thing. Let me. Not, not that. Uh, is there not a way for me to check? Oh, the guard. Oh, we have roll. Cool. Uh, control settings. Guard, crouch. Well, crouch guard. Drop ability. Well, it's fine, but I'm um, trying to figure out if they had a, a screen for a... What you call it? When it comes to like old Kirby games, you can press star and be like, oh, this is the sword ability. This is what kind of cool tricks you can do with this. I guess you don't have that. And this. I remember growing up and uh, seeing, well, whenever I talked about Smash Brothers and Kirby and like with my friends in elementary school, people thought that the up special from Kirby was sword. Because, well, he does think, but actually, it's Cutter. And that just always reminded me whenever I see Cutter. I was like, yeah, Kirby's up here. But, oh wait, it actually keeps the thing here. Can I just pick it up again? No. Uh, does it eventually disappear? Probably does. Bomb Kirby. I don't know why we all just added Kirby at the end of all abilities. Not that like, there's a problem or anything, but... But, uh, bomb has changed a lot. Ooh, no! My bomb! Beforehand... Ooh. Please don't me have infinite jumps. Thank God. Uh, but wasn't it, like, old bomb... Did he have a hat on? Or was it just he threw, he threw bombs? It wasn't until, I think, Return to Dreamland or, like, one of the 3DS games where they gave him this, like, party hat. I'll put on those like old school abilities that I remember and like. It's not my favorite ability. My favorite ability is a tie between Cutter and Beam. Those are my two favorite abilities. Oh, I can hold the button. You know what I would like to see? Just it's not even Nintendo, but a game come back is what's the his name? Bomberman. I get like a 3D platformer kind of thing, like the old 64 games. So we have this car mouth. Turbo dash, jump. 
Honestly, when I saw you, you keep your ability. That's cool. I remember when I first saw this, I was like, "That's the gimmick of this game." Um, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's not like it's bad or anything. It's just weird, actually. You would think that this would just give you the will ability if you were to swallow it. I can feel like this collectible, but I guess there isn't. Maybe when you get to actual levels? And something? I don't know. Maybe they're all collectible. I just don't know. That's down here. That must be something up there. Maybe it's just a whole bunch of coins, and the coins are just used for buying stuff. Because I know the whole thing with like the Waldy towns and stuff. Up here is uh, coins. Bridge. Okay, Kirby's adorable. I love this little pink thing. And there's the logo for the game, the title screen. Maybe I should not go mute during this because how Nintendo does their whole copywriting videos. So if there's no audio here, it's probably because of that. Just, just saying. So did you turn the radio in your car on? I don't know how you would do that with uh, your hands on the outside. Or is it just that radio is super loud and you can hear it way over here? How laboratory? I remember seeing that logo when I first got Smash Brothers. Me and my brother were jumping from or two beds back and forth pretending with Smash Bros. characters and like, oh, who's in the game? <laughs> Even though the game did come out, uh, you could have got it yesterday. Uh, a lot of people, uh, oh, you have to hold this bit out. I thought B was to jump. No, it is not. Okay, good. But yeah, I know that this game did could have got it yesterday, but I haven't really watched anyone play it just because they don't want to get spoiled, I guess. Here comes Sir. Why do I have to drop my ability? Oh, that easy. You know, one ability I'm surprised they didn't bring into this game. Maybe it is in this game, I don't know. But with all these fox enemies, I'm surprised they didn't bring back Beast.
Oh, I have to touch it. I can't just kill the enemies holding on to it. You saved me, thank you. But what are all the about those other guys, the Waddle Dees? How do you know about Waddle Dees? Are you from Dreamland? They're all captured and taken away. We fought those bees as hard as we could, but they kept coming back for more. Now I'm the only one left. I have to go save them. I have to. Now you have Kirby. Oh, a pop star. Or warp star. Popstar is the name of the planet. What, you helped me save everyone? That's great! So, your name is Kirby. I'm Elfin. Elfin? I don't know. Nice to meet you. That's one thing about me. I struggle with pronouncing names. Hey, Kirby. Oh, it's Banana Waddle Dee. Play with two players. Play co op. Hey, this is when you unlock co op. Wow. What do you have to say? If you want a second player to join, just press plus. Nah, I'm good. Whee! Oh, so it is public level base. Natural planes. Downtown grassland. So there's no Collectibles. Is that where we're supposed to go? Is this Waldy Town? Doesn't seem like there's much you can do here. Probably a boss. Clouds covering up the next world, which looks like a desert slash beach level. Let me see this. Search. Woo! The coins are for something. Oh well. There's a star here. Clear the stage, save the hidden Waldies, and then there's three Waldies. Okay. Give me a new ability. I want new abilities. Nothing against bomb. But now that we unlocked more, do I get an idea of how to look at my abilities? There's no button. Oh. I feel like there is a way to check, but there's... No, there's not, sadly. Where's my menu for it? Okay, bomb is not really as fun. Because you have to like directly hit them to pull them up. It takes forever to probably just throw the bombs at each other. Oh, my favorite ability. Get out of here. The best ability in the game. Cutter. And I just dropped it. I love this. And look at the cool hat you get. I love cutter. It's the best ability in the game. And then we got, like, even the, my partner member you would've gotten, like, old Kirby games. Uh, sort of kibble, it's cool. I will switch. Looks like I can hold it there. Oh, that's so cool. So I don't have my classic ability of the slash and, like, up special kind of, like, ability. There's nothing else there. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is just basic abilities. Maybe they don't want to put that much work into it, I guess. Oh no, it's another mouth full mold. Vending mouth! Oh, I have 90 shots. No, Sir Kibble! How could. I love the wood I had on top of the fridge. Oh, can I pick this stuff up for health? Okay, that's kind of cool. Something in there. Uh, looks like the way we have to go, but there's also stuff over here. Oh, sorry, vending machine. There's a bull. Uh, seems like that's where we have to go. So that hidden area isn't where we have to go. So we have a woman to jump. Yeah, we do. Double checking. 
Make sure. Ooh, a capsule? What do we get? It doesn't show me. Ooh. Is it this location? No. There it goes. One thing I'm, I think it's a triple deluxe that had it, like the key change from like older Kirby games. That was cool. I wonder if that's what these capsule like things are. Can't go in there. There's a bomb again, but one's bombing. Oh, if you're next to an enemy, that's how you do it. We'll just kill bomb the old way. So there are ways to upgrade your abilities. Let me get to that ability that point. Cool. So I think this becomes chakrams when it's upgraded, which is super cool as well. No! Give me my cutter. I must always have it. It's my pride and joy. Now this cone mode. That that doesn't even fit. the metal boxes as well. Sorry, sir cable, but I must break your box. And then spot, but no. But we haven't found a cage yet, so hopefully it's not like hidden like super well. All these stages aren't that long. That. Not bad. Aha, uh -huh. we dodge everything. So, this is how we. Because I remember seeing this in the. Whatever that was, reveal trailer or game place. Oh, a capsule! Also, those three things. Oh, the capsules. We need one more capsule, I think. Right? A hey, five tulips bloom. Uh, break the building shutter. Ride this. Okay, so we got that. Oh, so I should be trying to make tulips uh, bloom. Oh, so the objectives are kind of like what's that? Kind of like in Kirby Dreamland Three. Those like objectives. I would have. Cutter a bomb. I choose cutter. Do like oh wild edge. I just hold that there. I know usually having the spit ability is better. So could I actually drop my ability, pick that up, spit it out, and then pick my ability up again? You're done. Goodbye, Wild Edge. That looks like it drops ability afterwards. Say like the world's him waddle dee. Oh, there's more to the level. Oh. I thought that was just the end of the level. Yeah, if there's only five to levels, I definitely missed it somewhere, but if there's more than five, we might still have a chance. Oh, we can pick up items with this? I can actually aim it. Yeah, we can. What is this? That was just a hidden model D. Cool. Oh, what is. What is right here? Oh, I touch it and. Pits these up, okay.
I haven't seen it. Whoa. Snake. Oh, it's not a turtle. I think it's a turtle. A snapping turtle. What does a pure... Ah, uh, sword. Not too... Wait, we can cut this. That's probably why they want sword up here for it. We need it for you. Oh, that did not work as planned. Oh, that was our third level D. The stage is coming to an end. And there's two turnips there. Oh no, this is probably a turnip. Oh yeah, make five stone blues. I only did one, so we're definitely not getting that objective done. So at least we know there's objectives that we can actually see beforehand. Unless you have to actually clear it first. more bigger than you don't hit me there at least Ow. That's a lot of distracts them go ahead and snap come back in come over here he breaks the thing easy now a third capsule Two turn ups and sad. So, golden, uh, whatchamacallit's cages all at the end of the stage. Oh, so we almost saved all the model D's. Ah, oh, volume one, Kirby. Kirby is pulled into a mystery vortex. Number two, Warp Star. One, one, Cappy. Ah, oh, interesting. <laughs> Through the tunnel. So I think what I want to do is in between episodes, I'm going to go back in 100% the level if I did not 100%. Uh, so I want to go back and do this in between the episodes. So. I know some people, whenever new games come out, they try to make these long videos, but I still want to treat these like a Let's Play, so 25 minutes for non-RPGs is what I try to aim for. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Kirby in the Forgotten Land. See you guys later.